So, what's up, my laddies? My name is XFF Gaming, and welcome back to Minecraft Snapshot 16W41. So, goodbye, crew home. You've been a temporary home, temporary home, and am I going the right direction? This is the right direction, it seems, yes. So, I've got some food. Not these pumpkins, but we have actually got like four pieces of bread and an apple. We have a bed, which we can always sleep in. Okay. Um, yeah, this has been a good starting place, but... Yeah. Oh, jeez. Uh, so... I've been playing a lot of multiplayer lately. Oh. Wait a second. I think I've just discovered something. Over there in the distance. Hello, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Impossible lava lake. Thank God we, uh, our village is nowhere near this lava lake, but Jesus, this thing is beautiful. And this will be f would, would be really useful if we would play modded. But no, we aren't playing modded Minecraft, we're playing normal Minecraft. So this lava lake is pretty much useless. Unless we want to, I don't know, make a base fully out of obsidian just barricade ourselves in, in obsidian everything yeah that would probably be a good idea so we'll remember this lava lake but we'll head off into the dire direction of our village so yeah for anyone who missed last episode what the fuck uh, like seriously, why have we missed last episode? Um, but if you actually missed last episode and you're too lazy to watch it, um, there we I talked about changes in the Minecraft snapshot, and there were a few things I really liked. So, where is this three seventy six? All right. We've got a 200 block away, 200 meters, not that bad, like, if you ask me. Bunnies, Jesus Christ. They scared the shit out of me. They were actual bunnies. Oh, and hello there, village, I think. Ow. It has a smithy. The village has a smithy. Awesome. So this is the path. Ha! Huh. 26 paper for an emerald. Actually, that's okay price. 9 leather for paper. A lot of stuff. So yeah, there's nothing in these homes. I could use this home. I could move into this home. Yes, that'd probably be a good idea. Or I could move into the tower. They have radishes. Nice. But the most important thing is right here. Boom. <gasps> oh. Oh. One block of obsidian. That's all we need. And we can already go to the nether. Like, what the hell? This was awesome. And we've got an iron pick. That was actually not that bad. I must say. Now, sorry villager, but I need to take this home. This is now mine.
Uh, um, do this. I actually have a torch in here. That's good. That's good. That. So, yeah, I've been experimenting around and damn it. I've been experimenting around in uh on the server I was playing a lot on. Damn it. And I think I've built myself my own design for a um what you call it? I mean, I forgot. The melon farm. Pumpkin melon farm. Uh, but I think myself I think myself that this melon farm is a little bit too inefficient. But we'll see about that. The only restriction I had is for this farm is I had to build it semi semi automatic or manual. Because, well, manual is, you know, the regular. But I had to build it semi-automatic because a fully automatic fa farm is uh, restricted. Well, you ca uh, aren't allowed to build one because, damn it. Did I just make one big mistake? Not that big, no. Actually, no. Are you afraid? Uh, I was afraid we would run out of wood. Damn it. So on the server, fully automatic farms are f are forbidden due to lack reduction, and that's it. That was my only uh, restriction. But I think now that we are playing single player and we play on my PC who can handle Minecraft pretty decently, I say we are allowed to build... Oh. Oh, that's... Oh, Jesus, I thought... Well, no, whatever. Um, I say we can build any farm we want. Because why the heck not? No. There you go, ugly acacia wood. Well... Stuff, stuff, stuff. Now, well, we, I think we want wheat, yes. I think using these fellas here, the villagers, are going to make some autom fully automatic farms. Actually, I I don't know. Is there a is there already a um, recipe for um, observa uh, observer blocks? Because if not, I'll have to check. So yeah, we move to this village. Oh. Jesus. Ten minutes. All right. We move to this village. Everything's okay, and we will get on mining. And we've already got iron ore. Hmm. 
<laughs> Jesus Christ, what? Uh, I've broken the holy rule of Minecraftism. Never dig straight down. What if there was lava under that diorite block? I would have been dead. And I would have spawned right back where I started. Because I haven't slept here. Actually, while we are here... Because I'm a clumsy... Oh, damn it. <laughs> I'm... I'm an idiot, yeah. Uh, I am a clumsy player and I die a lot. And we do not want me losing all of my shit. Also, that means if we are done mining, we can just kill ourselves and come back to spawn. Well, after we've slept, of course. Did it ding? Five levels. One true downside to this um, to playing like this alone in single player is you cannot really <gasps> fuck, fuck, fuck. Let's leave that there, shall we? Because I'm too scared to go down there. I will not go down there. I do not want to go down there. Is it night time yet? Looks like it. There's a zombie villager, creeper, some nasties outside, and I don't have a sword. That's going to be a problem, an issue. Could you please get out of here? Please, Mr. Villager. Whatever, fine. Just stay there. Now you wanna- Oh, now you wanna go! Oh, now you wanna fucking go! Oh, you mother- You mother of God! Jesus Christ. So, yeah. I think we end this on here. We successfully managed to move here. We... Starting to establish room of operations base of operations and I think we'll just mine a lot I'll I'll just mine a lot until we have a lot of resources and we can start working on other stuff so yeah that was it for this episode if you like this video or just like nice person click the like and the subscribe button also like me on Facebook and comment on which game we should play next so peace